Hi guys, welcome back to my official YouTube channel. And the video that I'll be sharing with you today is the 1998 Jones Cup Championship game between the Philippines and Chinese Taipei. So, sama-sama natin panoorin. Jones Cup, pag makikita mo, ba, meron din silang uh, popping it up there. And alam mo, for the first time, ha, medyo ang ating kupo nandito, hindi makakakuha ng uh, home, hometown uh, crowd. Actually, medyo maganda rin ang uh, support ang binibigay ng ating mga kapwa Pilipino who uh, happen to be working in Taipei That's and right. come out in full force to give support to uh, our Centennial team. And part of itong championship game, so appropriate because Chinese Taipei and the Philippines remain the only unbeaten teams dito sa Jones Cup. And immediately, ang bumutas ng ating net si Cheng ng uh, Chinese Taipei. And the crowd goes wild here as... Uh, the Republic of China goes on top by two points here and in the start of our uh, championship game. A partner, Si Cheng, no, has a lot of moves down the baseline, also a good outside shooter. Sa play and ni Patrimonio. Si Cheng, partner, happens to be the highest salaried basketball player in China. Ka, on, on average uh, salary yata niya on a month is about mga 250,000 pesos Aba. equivalent. Pwede na siyang uh, para starter dun sa ating PBA, you know. Tumatala sa blind tira ni Wang. Here's Verhel Menezes, or rather Kenneth Durendes. Very They'll composed, na. Yes. Very composed ang Philippine team natin, eh. Menezes. Inilabas ki Durendes. Three-point shot. Wala. So far, wala pang mga ipapasok na tira ang Philippine team. Good uh, defense being played by uh, Chinese Taipei, but they're allowing that outside shot. So long as hindi makapasok ang Philippine team, sabi siguro ng Chinese coach, okay lang. Cheng again inside, pero wala. Yung kanyang layup this time. Makikita mo, mataas lumundag itong uh, si Cheng, ha? And he has very quick reflexes. Well, he's six, uh, three and a half. Yes, he does have good spring. Pero ang hirap, partner, kung titira siya sa ilalim, tapos nandun si Marlo, okay, no? you really have to think twice. Oh, Abarientos gets away from his yes. hand. And the Philippines is on the board with our first two points. Tapla po ang ating score, two all. No, partner, you hear the cheering in the background. There is a lot of oh. Filipino support sa stadium. And you can see the Philippine flag prominently displayed. Diyan po sa background sa municipal stadium ng Taipei. Outside shot, Cheng, wala na naman. Rebound, picked up by number eight. Offensive rebound at Chinese Taipei. Uh, that's an area the Philippines really must work on. Taking care of the defensive boards and not giving the opposition second, third attempts at the basket. Here's that last move, Ni Lo. This is Lo Xin Liang getting a foul from Johnny Abarentos in slow mo Puyan. Brought to you by McDonald's. Part Boy, bad pass. Yes, bad pass, a turnover. Entering the finals, back then, the Chinese Taipei beat Japan 71 to 68. The same team that we beat in overtime, 92-87. So that's the putos din. Oh, hey, hola. But sa atin nag uh, nag overtime sa kanila within regulation. Oh, na. At uh, tayo naman uh, entering the finals, we beat uh, Korea. Marlo Aquino, yes, stretching for the finger roll, and the Philippines on top by two, four to two. Alam Very si... serious ang uh, yung uh, itsura ng ating uh, mga Philippine players. No? They have their Very, game faces today. Yes. Very determined look on their faces. Well, it's been 13 years since we last tasted the Jones Cup. In the meantime, si Cheng muli. Nakabutas ng ating defense at mukhang yung uh, defense sa loob. Hindi masyadong uh, may fit ang makinig. Apart from nakakawala si Cheng. No? The baseline move is that nice moves. So we need to be able to be... Uh, Careful not to give him that opportunity. Oh, nice move. Mulaki Doremdes. Yes. After the pass. Kenneth Doremdes, who has played a statement tournament in this Jones Cup, has certainly blossomed as our top gunner. Gets the Philippines a two-point lead. While entering the finals, an average to Kenneth Doremdes because 16.4 points. No? And he has averaged, uh, but he has hit in double figures in four or five games so far. The only time he did Scoring double figures was in our 50-point blowout of Thailand. That's right. Hindi mo siya kailangan gumawa na doon. And you see the Philippine crowd. Oh, boy. Ang dami natin kababayan na talagang lumabas dito at manood itong championship game na ito. Oh, talagang nila. Marami silang pwedeng uh, i-cheer dito. Eh, oh, yes! Something to cheer about. Three-point shot. Set shot. 
Can he get that hell Menezes? PLDD long distance shot from the aerial Voyager. And the Philippines now storms ahead by five points here. Panori natin ulito. Set shot. Bottom of the net. A high arching shot by Verhel Menes. At sabi niya, yes! Partner, iba talaga if you're playing for the Philippines. Oh, no? iba talaga. You're full of pride and when you hit that shot, doubly emphatic ang expression mo. Alam mo yun ang sinasabi nga niya ng maraming tao. Makikita mo dito sa mga malalaro natin as we take a look at this last foul ni Verhel Menezes. It's different when you look at them now. Hindi ba yung... Uh, Tatamad-tamad, hindi ba yung uh, tatamlay-tamlay? They're really playing with a lot of fire and it's different when you wear that Philippine flag on your chest. Talagang iba yung pakiramdam. Lalong-lalong tayo dito sa Maynila na talagang uh, everybody is uh, praying for this PBA Centennial team. Oh, a three-point shot. Wala kay number 13, Lee. Lee Yun Kung. Maliit ito pero marunong din bumira sa labas. Mukhang deadly. And oh, partner, there's e never been any doubt that we have the talent. Man for man, as far as Asian basketball is concerned, we have the talent. Yung lalang, yung preparation, and yung training time. Pero ngayon, with uh, the excellent preparation being given to the Centennial team, and dito natin makikita yung, uh, yung kagalingan natin in the Asian realm. And of course, yung bunga ng paghihirap itong uh, Kukunani Coach Tim Cohn. They really done everything to prepare for the Asian Games and a great move inside from number six man that is Lin Xing Hua ito si Lin partner is six six and a half so he's got the height oh. to be able to move inside and power nearly five minutes gone by ito po sa championship game and Jones Cup Marlo oh. Aquino on the post once again and it will be very difficult for the Chinese to stop Marlo pag nandun sa pwesto niyo he's the tallest man on the floor and definitely he will post up he will want the ball and he's got the agility to make those moves to the basket. Lee, siya po nagdadala ng bola ngayon para sa Chinese Taipei. The Philippines on top by two. Lababa sa screen. Binalik sa kay Wang. Or rather that is... Sige ba yun? Rebound ni Wang. Pero napating yung bola. Libre ni Luis Adoretes. Tinaktak ng dalawang kamay. And the Philippine crowd now going wild here. As the Philippines goes back on top by four with 14 and a half remaining in the first half. Fight that even the Chinese Taipei fans must applaud because that was just a spectacular play by Kenny Durandes. Filipino man, a Chinese Taipei fan, a play like that deserves a plus. And a good tap to Lucky Dani Abarientos on that uh, drive by Lee or Lin, Lin Xing Hua. And the Filipinas once again back on top and in possession. Ano pa kaya ang chemistry ng Philippine team? Nakikita natin, no? So unselfish, they're passing the ball around, looking for the open man. And that pass coming from Marlo Aquino, Alvin Pachimonio using the glass. What more can you say? Alam mo, precisely, Pilito, the big difference in the game of the Philippines now is their crisp passing. Ang bilis na ng passa. They don't handle the ball too long, but they're very patient on their offense. Yes, a partner yung uh, tentativeness na pinakita ng Philippine team in that exhibition against China. Hindi rin natin nakikita na yun. Exactly. And the point that Coach Tim Cohn uh, made no, after that exhibition game against uh, China was ang kailangan itong team na ito, sabi niya, game exposure, yung experience, yung gelling by gaining the experience and exposure of playing together. Ito, naki nakukuha na ngayon ng Centennial team natin. At nakukuha na rin po natin yung outside shooting. Johnny Abarientos banging away from the outside. And it seems like the Chinese Taipei team will need a timeout as the PBA Centennial team goes berserk. Here in the first half, we're on top as we take a look at this last three-point bomb ni number 13, Lee. And of course, the inside shot ni number 6, Lin. But that's not enough to overhaul a big Philippine lead as Kenneth Duremdes goes all the way to the hole. And it's been an exciting first few minutes of this game, Benito. We're on top by 7, 18, 11. My partner, now what can you say? Marlo Aquino getting the, the points inside. Me, meron tayong outside shooting. Yung running attack nando doon. Ang ganda ng pinapakita ng depensa ng Philippine team. Everything seems to be working. No? The gelling, the chemistry, nandito na. No? And the championship is here for the taking. Abot tanaw na nga, ika nga yung uh, corona ng Jones Cup. Ika nga, naaamoy na natin. And we're certainly going for it, but of course, this Chinese Taipei would, won't be here if they're not a tough nut to crack. 
Well, of course, we all know that uh, itong uh, host team, no? Oh. Ito, number 14 Aba player. Na. Yes! Yun ang mga lipad. Yes, yes, si, na naman, oh, si Cheng na naman. Si Cheng. Akala ko number 14 yun. But yes, it's that half American, half Chinese. Again, scoring. Cheng Chi Lung. Getting another basket from the outside. Marlo Aquino, nilabas ni Verhel Meneses. Open jumper. Patay na naman para kay Verhel Meneses, who is slowly picking up his scoring here. He's been very quiet. So, pensa niya in the last maybe uh, five games, but certainly today, they know this is it. This is this is the championship. Oh, partner, parang napapansin niyata ng Centennial team that yung depensa ng uh, Chinese Taipei is not extending to stop the outside shooters. Maluwag ganun. Oo, oh, oh, maluwag na maluwag. Kanya, uh, our Philippine players are getting nice looks and they're getting good attempts. Oh, nice follow-up. Malaki Wang off a miss there. Wang getting an offensive rebound. No boxing out from the Philippines. Watch this again. This slow-mo brought to you by McDonald's and a great follow-up, Malaki Wang, huh? Yes, a nice penetration, but ang magandang pinakita ni Marlo Aquino, tumulong siya sa depensa. No? Ito naman! Uy! Sablay lamang yung dakdak. And no foul. Speeding to the front court, number 13. That's me, and he gets the basket. We'd like to thank, thank FedEx, the transportation company of the Jones Cup Games. FedEx will live to deliver. Partner, big run here oh. by uh, Chinese Taipei. Goes to show you that this team really wants to win this championship no maganda rin yung time out na tinawag ng Chinese Taipei to stop the momentum eto nakaupo na upo niyo pa naupo ni Marlo yung pa nitong uh, player ng uh, Chinese Taipei tuloy hindi makapasa inside oh nice move mula kay Wang and they've made a run a big run here it's all tied at 20 all oh well, partner yung si Wang was able to get that shot in because si Marlo Aquino stayed uh, in the backcourt oh so he was uh, able to score unmolested. Alam natin ito si Wang. He's 6'7", 27 years old. Ito naman si Marlo! Ito ang inyo! Skyscraper! Six points in the ball game para kay Marlo Aquino. Great pass inside. Panoorin natin ulit ito. This slow-mo brought to you by McDonald's. And this slam dunk brought to you by Marlo Aquino. You know, parta dito si Marlo. Once he sets his mind to scoring and playing defense, he is definitely one of the best talents we have seen for a big man. Oh, in a Long, God. long time. Grabe rin ang outside shooting ha, ginito. Sito na naman si Cheng. Oh, partner, dapat siguro dikita na natin dito si Chen. Either that or maybe double team him because he is getting away with a lot. Uy! Dito sa laro na to. Buntik na naman yun. And here they come again. Run and gun. Here's... Ito, binibilisan talaga ng Chinese Taipei. And there will be a foul. And Alvin Pachamano said he was shoved. No, that foul will stick. It will be on Alvin. And the one uh, drawing the foul was Lee. Number 13 man and the speedy guy, two fakes, goes up. Nakakuha siya ng foul mula kay Alvin Patrimonio. Matapang itong uh, oh, player na to, ha? Alam mo, ang hirap gawin yun, ha? You know, he could have skidded it. Ah, hindi, oh. hindi, hindi naman. Medyo, hindi muntik na. Oo, oh, kumuntik na. Pero ang hirap gawin yun, no? On the dead run, he stopped. Two fakes and he picked up the foul from Alvin Patrimonio. Lee Yun, Yun Kung. Alam mo itong Chinese type bigin ito. Bagamat silang host, eh... They're showing that they deserve to play here. And certainly, maganda naman ang performance ng Chinese Taipei. Have they won the Jones Cup uh, ever? Never. Chinese Taipei once uh, finished second mm -hmm. in this tournament. Uh, Nung yatang uh, 1994. Kung di tayo nagkakamali, no? But uh, Chinese Taipei has never won this championship that was uh, started in 1977 in honor of the uh, first... Uh, FIBA Secretary General si William Jones of uh, Great Britain. Kaya naman nakikita mo overflow crowd dito po sa Municipal Stadium ng Taipei. Nice pass and alley you play para kay Verhelm Meneses. You really can see na nagjijel na itong ating mga bata. No? Uh, partner, uh, medyo napapabayaan na natin ang Chinese Taipei because Chinese Taipei was able to get a lead. Here's a three-point shot. Yes! Chinese Taipei has opened up a three-point lead here with good outside shooting coming from the big man at the uh, Oh yes. Bow kami, bow kami don. Bow na bow sila dun sa wow. Well, you know, definitely a six-seven player scoring from three-point range is something to marvel at. Oh, si Michael Jordan lamang ang gumagawa sa kasiskati pipe ni. Eto abariantos malito to. Sasaksak sa loob. Lord, oh beautiful shot from the flying A, and that lead is cut down to one. Twenty-seven, twenty-six. Lamang parin po ang Chinese Taipei. A partner, palagay ko, kayang-kayang to -kaya, one one-on-one ng Philippine team itong Chinese defense. Eh. Okay. As you see earlier, nice eto, step. two and baskets in a row for Johnny Abariantos. Good defense on one end, and he gets the job done on the other. Proud to be a Filipino. Yan po sinasabi ng ating mga kababayan dyan sa Taipei. And why not?
This team, the PBA Centennial team, has certainly made us proud. Manalo, matalo eh. Talagang ito na yung, uh, ano sabing, malayo na yung ating narating dito sa ating kampanya na pinito. Nice shot muli. Si Cheng na naman ang gumawa sa labas. Partner, you notice that uh, Coach Tim Cole now has two point guards on the floor. No, si Olsen kasi lang nagagala ng bola. But it's very clear that Coach Tim Cohn wants Johnny Abarientos to be involved in the offense. This is the first time that they've actually used this kind of uh, lineup, a dalawa yes. point guard. Actually, maliliit naman kasi ang players sa oh, backcourt ng Chinese Taipei. Ito no? e na naman, binaan na naman sa laki ni Marlo Aquino. Tumulong si Lee. You know, one thing that Olsen Marcelo has shown in this Jones Cup is his ability to play pesky one-on-one -on -one defense. Mm. Ito si Marlo Aquino, fouled, going up. Huling huli si... Lee Yun Kung reaching out. Laban to Marlo Aquino. And the skyscraper will go to the free throw line now. For a pair of free throws. Well, si Lee and uh, si Chi Chung Chi are the oldest players of the Chinese Taipei team. Both of them are 30 years old. Marlo Aquino with that familiar wrap around before taking his free throws. And it up. Rookie of the year is the PBA. 1996. And perhaps one of the best talents we've ever seen as a center coming out of the amateur league in a long, long time. Well, I think he clearly is the most dominant big man in Philippine basketball today. Oh. And perhaps even Asia, no? We were expecting him uh, to match up against uh, Yamasaki of Japan, so Jones Cup, but we will see that matchup. Yamasaki. Palagi ko, even sa Japan, no? and we will see that matchup in uh, the Asian Games of Bangkok. Outside shot, voila. Rebound, Dennis Espino has checked into the ball game. Espino, one of the steady players ng Pilipinas. Pinito dito sa Jones Cup. He has really played very good uh, basketball so dalim with Tim Cohn. Grandes na sa labas. Marlo Pino inside, gets away again. And that oh, yes! Difficult. On the reverse. Yes, reverse layup para kay Marlo Aquino. Hello, hello, Christelle. Hello, my partner. The competition in this Jones Cup is really good. Oh, the many guys are saying that you're sorry, yeah, we. The two of them were champions. They're from Japan. 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 If Korea in, uh, wanted to hide its stars, okay lang, no? I think it will backfire. Oh. Because pinago uh, din nila yung dalawang star nila sa World Championship sa Athens. Problema na nila yun. Oh, problema nila yun. <laughs> Lamantala, si Marlo Aquino, keyhole jumper, patay na naman. And Marlo Aquino having a field day here. Oh, partner, a big man like Marlo, he can simply score over anyone else on the floor because he is that tall. Oh. And alam natin ito si Marlo when he takes his jump shot. Both his arms are raised above his head. There's no way you can block his jump shot. Dominating this first half. Marito si Lee. Nigay Ki Wang from the outside. Oh, the big man can shoot. Oh, yes, indeed. Ayan na naman. <laughs> na pa nagsasambay itong dalawa eh. Di ba may kamagana kaya ito ni John Strickland yung mga yun. 33-32 is the score. One point lead para sa Republic of China. Well, it's really been close and the Republic of or rather the Chinese Taipei team still can't give up the lead to the Philippines. Oh, mahirap ko tira yun. Turn around with Dennis Espino falling down and Lee has the leather. Inside to Law. Nilabas muli kay Lee. Inilabas kay Xiang, a new guy inside the basketball court and sablay ang kanyang tira from the outside. Marlo Aquino now beginning to walk. Akin ito, alam natin na medyo... Alam mo, this game has been played at a very fast pace. Up and down pace. Baba kong napag-aralan ng Chinese type yung defense, yung play na yun. Another offensive rebound, Marlo Aquino, wala! And the rebound by Xiang. A lot of bumping and grinding partner. Right? Kasi Marlo Aquino, I think, might be oh, a little look. tired at this stage. <laughs> to want to buy to mga fans ng Chinese Taipei because now they have another shot. Hey, yes! yes! Oh, another one Wong. from Wang. Another three-point shot. Ito na naman yung dalawa. Dalawang komiko. <laughs> Parker, this is a four-point lead. With 5.20 remaining here in the first half. Abarientos off the glass. Wala. Rebound na naman ng Chinese Taipei. And now, 
The Chinese Taipei making the Philippines pay at mukhang yung depensa natin has to extend din ito ha puro, puro lapas ang uh, tiyan nito mga Chinese Taipei well, players especially ha? one George, oh. number 15 player who's supposed to be a low post player taking the shots from 3 point range no cross court pass dangerous pass the number 14 that is Wu Wu Chu Wei he played defense in Mario Aquino he distracted that well, the Chinese Taipei team has made a run and they have overtaken the Philippines here behind tremendous outside bombing. Kami po ni nito ay babalik right after this. Sa Pilipinas, he, his reputation is widely known. Certainly, has shown and proven it once again. Dito sa Jones Cup. Well, partner, so far, napakaganda ng outside shooting na pinapakita ng uh, Chinese Taipei. No? They've been able to rain those rainbows, draining them, and uh, apat na naman ng Chinese Taipei at this stage. Talking about Alan Kaidik, na sa loob na siya kasama si Jojo Lastimosa at si Jun Limpot. Completing the cast, Dennis Espino and also Rasela. And Kaidik takes his first shot. Patay kagad! And we're talking about Alan Kaidik. Welcome, Mr. Kaidik. My partner, sa nakikita natin, depends on pinapangita ng uh, Chinese Taipei. No? It's uh, almost a combination of a man-to-man -man defense and zone. I said once that ball is inside, they really don't go man-to-man. -man, no? They rely on their zone to stop the penetration. And look at this, Benito. Huh? Tumatao ni Cheng. Si Olsen Rosella. Cheng is the hottest hand on the floor for the Chinese Taipei. Supply and tier, offensive rebound. Number six, that is uh, Lin, kicks it out. Cheng again. Almost loses his uh, footing. Got to make bump foul in the power of Laban to Olsen Rosella. Well, partner, I think this is great recognition on the part of Coach Tim Kong uh, to put Olsen Rosella on the top gunner, no? Si Cheng. Alam ni uh, Coach uh, Kong ito si Olsen Rosella. Eh, talagang uh, tumaglaro ng depensa. <laughs> it's so pesky. Oh. And he's on top of you all the time. Talagang iinising ka nito. Pagka medyo, na, medyo napikun ka dito, eh, masisira yung laro mo. Number seven is in the game. That is uh, Hu Cheng Shin. A good opportunity for Johnny Abarientos to take a rest at this stage. Ito naman, Marcella versus Chen. Chen doesn't know whether to post up. Ito, yung pasa. Lin, binigay kay Wang, nabitawan. Marcella getting to the ball quicker than Cheng. And he gives it to Alan Kaidik. That is what also Marcella gives this team, eh? Yung speed, yung quickness niya, at saka yung hustle. Oh, hindi mo pwedeng tawaran niya. Eh. And look at the Filipinas. Medyo ina-Alaska itong si uh, oh. Lee. <laughs> alam mo, ikaw lang. Alam mo, nasa Maynila oh. ka, eh, no? <laughs> well, our kababayans there, talagang uh, proud na proud dito sa ating kapunan. Uy, napailalim. Ito si Hong. Medyo muntik ng masahod si Dennis Espino and Hoon will pick up the foul. Malaking-laking uh, player itong number 7, oh. si uh, Hoon, who stands 6-2. Uh, well, very stocky, parang nolilocks yun ang dating. Ano? Oo. Oh, oh. Espino nasa labas. Tatang kiwang, challenges. No space, very patient ang Pilipinas. Yung pot pumapost eh. Alan Kedik sa labas. At a pick. And there's gonna be a foul here. Oh, and they're gonna give up uh, oh. three free throws. Partner, the man to man defense sila ngayon, no? Siguro, alam nila, ito si Alan Kedik. Eh, tirador. Oh. Uh, especially against the zone defense. Ayun. Ito, tingnan natin. Ayun yung pagsundot ni Hung. Slomo brought to you by McDonald's. Alam mo, partner, ito si Hung. Mukha yata ang enforcer, no? Oh. And, uh, Chinese Taipei putting an enforcer on... Top gun, the trigger man, Alan Gaidik. Masakit tayo yata yun. Masakit yun. Oh. Nakikita mo naman edad ni Alan Gaidik. Although, ipagkakaila oh. niya yan. <laughs> oh, pag uh, sinabi mo, naglaro ka naman doon sa championship team ng Jones. Oh, andun ako. Nandun ako noong 1990 uh, Beijing, 1994 Hiroshima. Andun ako lahat. Ano <laughs> mo, partner dito si Alan Gaidik. Eh. Matalik natin na kaibigan. 35 oh, years yes. old nga siya, pero... Kita naman kung, uh, kung kumilos, partner, parang 25. And remember, Alan Kedik... Babyface pa, no? Oh, he was a last-minute addition to this PBA Centennial team. 
in recognition ng kanyang ginawa dun sa Commissioner's Cup, of course. Ating uh, bayan ng superstar sa PBA and certainly si Coach Tim Tom bumili po. At alam niya nakakailangan ng si Alan Kaidik pagdating sa international competition. Alan Parker yung three-point shot. Or not even the three-point shot. Just the outside, outside shot, shot yes. in the international game. He's such a potent weapon. And of course, his experience will help a lot. Nakikita mo yan yung the way he plays defense, the way he paces himself, the way yes. he... He tries to uh, egg on his teammates to deliver. And I'm a partner because the Alan Gaidi can also share many of his experiences with his teammates. And I'm sure he is. Oh, oh he's doing that. Well, actually, a lot of his uh, a lot of his teammates have had uh, vast international experience. Like Nina Mario Aquino, si na. Oh, he's not one of them. Falling down and everything, he curled to his uh, right. And si Espino, he curled to his left. And he was falling down when he made that basket. Si Cheng gives Chinese Taipei back a two-point lead. Lastimosa. One and one. Laban kay Lo. Lastimosa turns around. Off the glass. Wala. Cheng with another rebound. Parang 2-3 zone defense yun. Ah. Nakita natin. Hindi naman talaga man-to-man. -man. Oh. Dalawang minuto. Labing apat na saglit po. Nalalabi sa ating first half. Kami po'y nagagalak na nagpupuyat kami kayong kasama namin mga kaibigan para sa ating kampinato o dito sa championship game ng Jones Cup. Wally Yala po kasama si Kinito Henson. Here's Cheng driving in. And there's gonna be a blocking foul called against Olsen Rosella. And Olsen knew it. Partner dito si Olsen. Alam niya ta kung anong mga tendencies nito ni Chen. I think he knew he was going to drive to the left. He was trying to overplay him. You know, I like the way. Oh, I like the way this Cheng plays, huh? Very sound fundamental, yung kanyang fundamentals, and certainly yung kanyang quickness ginagamit yung ng gusto gusto. Eto na naman si Cheng, kung mo post na ngayon, inilabas niya, libre si Lo sa labas, wala. Rebound ni Wang, offensive rebound, up against Lipot, good position para kay Wang and Chinese Taipei back on top by four. Partner, ito si Wang. He's doing a lot of damage. As well as Cheng, no? Yan ang kanilang one-two punch. Number 15 and number 12. Wang, a very agile player for 6'7". And Jun Lin Po, talk about agility. Nice shot, medium range. The big deal, cutting down that lead ng Chinese Taipei sa dalawa na lamang. Yan po ang nalalabing oras. A minute and 15. I don't recall a game where the Philippines trailed at the half pinito, ha? Because of Jones Cup so far. Outside shot, wala. And Limpot gets the rebound. Again, Coach Tim Cohn playing the Santa Lucia connection. No? Espino and si Jun Limpot yes. playing together. Ito si Jojo Lasimosa asking for the ball. Kanina, nakikita natin, he was uh, posting up. Espino looking to run the triangle. Rancela nasa labas. Poste si Dennis Espino. Laban si Wang. Goes inside. Natapik ang bola. And there's going to be a foul called against Wang Chun Xiong. Quickly, pinalikuran niya. Ito yung play. Boom! Uy! Lakas na hataw, pero may, may kasamang uh, hagip ng kamay. Ang Chinese type po, wala pa sa penalty. Baseline inbound. Nahihirapan si Olsen. Less than a minute remaining here. Philippines led by as many as 7 points kanina. 18 to 11. 3 points! Shot! The trigger man, Alan Kaidik. PLDD long distance shot that gives the Philippines back a one point lead with 32 ticks remaining. Alan Kaidik feeling it now. Yes, indeed. At napakaganda ng kanyang tira. Biglang uh, nabulabog itong coaching staff ng Chinese Taipei as the Philippines goes on top by one here. We'll be back for more action. Ito po sa Jones Cup. Inside. The other thing about that, Pinito, alam niya na mas maliit yung kanyang buma yung bumapantay sa kanya. So he was taking it above the head of his guard. At saka yung bola pumunta sa kanya. Oh. I have seen in many instances, ito si Alan Kaidik begging for the ball. At hindi na pumunta sa kanya yung bola. Pero dito sa Centennial team, I think there is great uh, recognition respect. Oh. and respect for each other's abilities. No? Kung mali libre or if you're feeling it, you're gonna ask the ball, you're gonna get it. Now that timeout was called by Charlie Taipei to map out the final play. And there's gonna be a foul called against Marlo Aquino with only that much time remaining, 25 seconds. Alam mo, partner, ito si Marlo Aquino was the one who was trying to play the trap. And uh, I don't know, no? Um, sayang kasi yung foul na Binigay ni, ni Marlo, oh. no? Um, you need, for a big man, you need to preserve your fouls, no? At uh, dapat eh, hindi naman siguro, hindi ka bang uh, magta-trap sa, sa backcourt kung malaki ka. 
Final moments of the first half. And they got another foul. Wala pa yata sa penalty. And Centennial team Wala pa. still picking up uh, a lot of those fouls. No? With less than uh, 30 seconds to go. That's the second foul within that period. Yan po si Cheng. Cheng Chi Lung. And superstar ng Chinese Taipei. Who has had a hot hand. It is the first half. Seven seconds remaining. Lin. And he left Lin, oh, Lin outside shot, voila, rebound in Dennis Espino, Demog Tatapos on our first half. A, just a one-point lead for the PBA Centennial team, a precarious lead against this tough, tough Chinese Taipei team. Si Tim Kohn, alam natin na marami pag-uusapan sila ng ating kapanan as we prepare for the second half in our championship game. This is a William Jones Cup, Chinese Taipei versus the Philippines. We'll be back in just a short while. Welcome back mga kababayan, dito po sa Municipal Stadium ng uh, Taipei for the championship game ng Pilipinas at saka ng Chinese Taipei. Tayo po yabante at the half, 41 to 40 at kami nagagalak na patuloy na kasama nyo kaming nagpupuyat o kasama namin kayo nagpupuyat para dito sa larong ito. And we're just about ready to start the second half. Marlo Aquino at the uh, circle, center circle, up against Wang ng Chinese Taipei. Exciting game, talagang championship pa. Uh... Contest na kapanood natin, no? Because uh, it is so tight, classic encounter between the only two unbeaten teams sa Jones Cup. Even the atmosphere kini ito, ha? Uh, this is a championship atmosphere. Talaga namang masaksakan ng dami pong tao. At ang tao, very animated. Oh, a great drive. Cheng was also the one who started scoring in this ball game, and he also sets the tone. Dito sa second half, abante ang Chinese Taipei by 1.42 to 41. Parker, big role here for Kenny Fernandez. He is uh, taking the touches for the Philippines offensively, but he's also guiding it to si Chen. Yes, matrimonio. Doremnes. PLD, the long distance shot para kay Captain Marvel. Bayan ang mga superstars indeed, the PBA Centennial team. And they're back on top by two points, 44 to 42. Alam natin ang ganda sa Taipei, napapanood ang PBA ganito. Kaya tayo ay uh, may mga takes na, na pinapatuloy sa ating mga kababayan. Kaya ito mga ito ay... Eh. Ito, cop-out situation oh. for Chinese Taipei. Pakita nila, nandun si Mario Aquino. Parang nag-travel pa si Lin. Sablay yung tira. Parker, yung defense natin na talagang matindi na. Tumitindi. And the Chinese Taipei team feeling the pressure. Oh, yes! Nice pass inside! You play Meneses and Durendes, they used to play together. It was a RFM franchise, and they're playing beautiful music again. Unselfish play by Benel Meneses. Pass, beautiful, nice execution by Kenny Durendes for the finish. Lee from the outside, voila, tapik. Napulok. Lin, nilabas ke Cheng. Oh, nice sliding play, pick and roll. Lin will be fouled by Verhel Meneses. Ling Xinhua will go to the free throw line. Magandang yung play na yun. Si Lin, getting the shot off, hindi lang pumasok. Maganda yung pasa galing kay Cheng. Outside to inside. Ito noong 1985 sa Jones Cup. Philippines also played Chinese Taipei. At manalo ang Philippine team at that tournament carrying the colors of San Miguel Beer. And scored nun at 80 to 66. Alan Kaidik had 13 points in that game, and Sam Boy Lim also had 13. Well, it seems like it's a different story today. As Chinese Taipei, mo kanta lang ang nagpasa na sila. It's been a long, long time since we played this team. At ibang iba na ang estilo ng kanila paglalaro. Lakay na improvement to na kanila. Ah, malaki talaga improvement. The last ABC Chinese Taipei finished sixth. Philippines finished eleventh. And of course, hindi naman yung ating kapunan na nandun. Samantala, wala yung tira ni Dorendes. And here comes Lo, getting a wave all the way to the basket. And the Chinese are back in this ballgame. Panorin natin ito. A fast break. Well, we'd like to thank FedEx, the transportation company of the Jones Cup Games. FedEx will lift to deliver. Meneses from the outside. Yes! BLDT long distance shot. Para kay Verhel Meneses, that's his second of the game. And the Philippine team hanging on to the driver's seat. Good outside shooting natin. Yeah, ang ganda. Palabas si Wang, tapik ni number six, that is Lin. 
A lot of partners again to end the stopping that ball to Johnny Abarientos. Nice play again off the rebound. Durendes, no shot, bounce pass, Abarientos quick release, voila. Juan gets the rebound, pero no, go on! Johnny Abarientos. Johnny Abarientos, out of nowhere, blinding speed, the flying A. And look at the crowd. In jubilation, Aquino's inside, and he gets hammered, battered. At may foul, it's called Glamen to Juan. Parker, it's si Juan, hindi ko nakapalitan. From the very first tip, Juan has played. Show you the... Confidence that the Chinese boom, Taipei boom. coach has Sakit on number 15 boom. player, yes. And tourist pa naman na siku nito si Wang, panorin nyo tuloy. Uy! Uy, naku. Sa kaya ngayon. Yan pong slow mo na yan, brought to you by McDonald's. Pante pa rin po tayo ng apat na putas, 49-45. Meneses, laban kay Cheng. One on one, Cheng. Oh, Meneses oh, gets yes. away! Oh, what a move! Oh, Pante sa one on one, dyan mo pwede talagang asahan nito si Bernard Meneses. No one can stop him one on one. They can't do it in the PPA, they won't do it in the Jones Cup. The premier one-on-one -on -one player ng Pilipinas, Verhel Meneses, and a bad pass by Ch the Chinese type of team, throwing that ball away, actually pinapasa dun sa referee. You know, partner, you see gawa ng tao, no? That's the Philippine crowd, oh, cheering the Philippines. At ang presyo yata, nandito na sa Chinese type, no? Here we go again, Meneses, one-on-one -on -one muli, na double team, inalabas kayo Barrientos, setting him up for a three-point shot! Oh, yeah! BLDT long distance shot oh, play for the Johnny A. Double team on Verhill. At partner si Verhill Meneses, another assist pass. Yes, now he's making it happen. A one and one move. Now a set up para kay Johnny and the lead is up to nine, 54-45. And a wink of an eye. Cheng, quarter court, takes a three. Too strong, picked up by Johnny. Probably the best rebounding small man in the business. Oh yes. I'm going to my big windows. Now we know it's a good thing for him. Menezes again. Laban sa mas maliit na si Lee. Gets away from Lee. Natapik ang bola. However, tumama huli. Okay, Juan. So it will remain with the Philippines. But it's been the aerial voyager show but Menezes picking up a three-point shot and a great assist and they certainly need a timeout now as the philippines is on a roll talagang grabe naman ang naidulot na galak ng ating ko pa dito sa ating mga kababayan na iba talaga yung feeling na when you see your national team playing it's a hard out um, your heart swells with pride oh. and of course kung uh, ganito nilalaro ng philippine team uh, you can't just be happy you're ecstatic. Oh. And, uh, you don't feeling, I'm sure, ng uh, ato mga babayan dito sa Taipei as the Centennial team has opened up a nine-point lead at sila pa may hawak ng bola. The pride of this whole nation as a balikat ng labindalawang mama natin dyan naglalaro sa Taipei. Samantala, sa playang tira ni Marlo Aquino at ang Chinese Taipei ngayon on the attack. They're down by nine. The Philippines led by as many as seven back in the first half pero nakahabol ang Chinese Taipei. Can they do it again? Here's Wang. Laban kay Patrimonio. Inaatrasan si Alvin. Wang inside. Nilabas kay Cheng. There's the defense of Durandes. Cheng gets inside. Wala yung tira. And Marlo gets the rebound. And there's gonna be a foul here. Pinigil ang laro. Nakaturo yung referee kay Berhel Meneses, it seems. And let's see what gives you. Parino foul daw ayun. Here's that move. Watch this here. Si Cheng. And then Meneses will... Ayun, may konting tulak sa likod. Yeah. But it could have been a warding, no, on the part of Cheng well, as he came in. Kasi nandun si Marlo Aquino, and he had to change his shot. That's Lomo, brought to you by McDonald's. Alam mo, again, yung tulungan ng Philippine team sa rebounding, no? Si Alvin Pachimonio boxing out the big man, one para makakuha ng rebound si Marlo Aquino. Oh. Sa labas, si Lee. Here's Lin. Laban si Marlo. Power move, and he gets the basket plus a foul. Laban si Marlo Aquino. And that's what we were saying. This Chinese type team seems to be a unit na mabilis ang recuperating abilities. Uh, partner, I think uh, they need to, no? Nice move. Maganda yung power move from the inside that uh, despite the presence of uh, Marlo Aquino. You watch this uh, this play right here. Si Marlo Aquino didn't really get his feet off the ground. He didn't try to block the shot. He tried to hold his ground. 
Lin Mesino. Ano na oh. yung uh, three-point play opportunity. Dito na po ang three-point play. Dito pa rin ang bati natin. 14 and a half remain in the second half. They're looking for the Jones Cup today. Abarientos. Kinagigibalo ang ganda ng pass. Oh, oh, yes, oh. Galit na galit. Nakikita mo naman yun. Agat ang lapi. Oh. And you can see in his eyes. So emphatic. Oh, yes. May punctuation mark yung ginawa ni Mario Aquino. And that, of course, will be a big moral booster no, for the Philippine team. As if they've been playing all their life together. Here's Lee. Binigay ki Cheng. He's inside. Nice move. And you, you have to like the way this Cheng moves without the ball to meet him. Huh? Like even with the ball, the way he moves around. Ito. Ito man, oh, oh. He really looks for the open space and looks for the ball. Huh? And of course, your baseline. That's where he makes a living. Mero kang tira sa labas, but he loves to cut down the baseline. Torrembes, oh! Ito, 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 baseline move then to get it to Rembes. Wrap around both. Oh, Torrembes. And the Chinese type of coach giving instructions to his boss. Pag sinasabi niya, okay, sino may no suggestion how to stop this? Ito lang jogger na ito matigilin natin, no? So many guns firing here for the Philippine Centennial team. Cheng again, no! After that pass gets by Cheng. Siya na talaga nagdadala ng Chinese type A. This is a shootout in Taipei. Durante speaking, and he draws the foul, Laban to Cheng. Chinese Taipei only committed four fouls back in the first half. On Filipinas, the man had seven. Here's that last foul, the slow-mo brought to you by McDonald's. Piper, kanina binigit ko that the Philippines finished 11th in the last ABC. I correct myself, we finished 9th. No 1993 sa ABC. That was the time when the Philippines finished 11. But uh, again, no, hindi naman natin pinapadala yung Philippine uh, Basketball Association All-Star Team no? sa ABC. Pero ngayon, iba na ngayon ang nilalaro. This is the Centennial Team made up of PBA All-Stars showing what they can do sa Jones Cup. It's a foul called against Cheng. It's a one-on-one -on -one move ni Verhel Meneses. Watch it again. Poetry in motion. Verhel Meneses getting clipped. And he will go to the free throw line. I'm finished no head and shoulder fake in No, no free throws being given to Meneses. Just an inbound para sa Pilipinas. Chant of defense. Abarientos fall away jumper. Wala. Wang gets the rebound. Ito sabi ng Chinese Taipei. Let's set it up. Let's execute in the half court. Lee with the leather. And I think the reason why they are calling for the half-court execution is because wala si Marlo Aquino sa loob. That's true. So they probably feel that, uh, oh, hindi naman po pwede yun. They try to penetrate, losing the handle. Ito, fast break attack. Meneses. No opportunity. At tira ni Meneses. <laughs> Kabodig na. May blocking foul. Ito tawag laban sa Chinese Taipei. <laughs> Look of frustration on the part of the Chinese Taipei coach. Ito yung uh, move ni Ben Hel Meneses. Alam mo kung pumasok yun eh, that would have brought the house down. Again. Shake and bake move, Verhel Meneses, the man of a thousand and one moves. Ang kinawagan ng foul si Lo. Philippines still on top here. Lastimosa, dapat kay Lee. Right side of the floor, Lastimosa nagkitawa ng bola, tinapik palabas, it will remain with the Philippines. Officiating has been very fair. No? Mm -hmm. In a situation like that, could have gone the other way. No? I don't know. We believe we're going to give one done. Oh, oh. Both. For both teams. Right, because the candidate is uh, looking to post up. Patrimonio. Cross court. Abarientos. Can't seem to find an opening. Patrimonio will take a three. Yeah! BLDT long distance shot for Alvin Patrimonio. He watched his step and he buried that one from oh, over 20 feet. Partner, Sapuna Laman of Philippines and Daniel team. Thanks to that Alvin Patrimonio three point bomb. But when he gets Nakalahati Napoleon, he'll have to the second half. Wang Hooligan, he's going to have Outside shot again, Wang. And the defense now starting to crank up. 
by the Malacanila. 6-7 blocked by uh, Kenneth Durendes. Yeah, kind of block ah, no. From nowhere. Unbelievable block by Kenneth Durendes. Here he is. Kenneth Durendes. Oh boy, another three-point shot. He held it the longest shot again for the PBS and Kenneth team. Merciless the Philippine team here, no? Meron ang killer's instinct. That's right. And that is something we didn't see in that exhibition against uh, the Chinese team. Ngayon may killer's instinct. I think they're very confident of what they can do on the floor as a unit, as a team. In the first half, we shot almost 63% from the field. And Chinese Taipei about 53%. But here in the second half, talagang nagiinit na po ang ating mga bataan. Especially from downtown. Ito si uh, Cheng partner. He's a one-man wrecking crew now for Chinese Taipei. He's not getting any support. They move it around. Avarietas is the open man. Muntik ng bumasok yun. Ito, keeping the ball alive. Again, it's that ability not to keep the ball alive. Yes. To get a second attempt at the basket. Zone defense now being played by China. At uh, mukhang tayo naman eh, spreading out the floor. Avarietas. Very patient sa kanilang offense. Across court, Lastimosa goes inside. Call away, jumper, wala, tapik ni Patrick oh, Mondo. Yes. Alvin Ando in right place. A tip in for the putback and Alvin the captain. And the Filipinos, na po sa municipal stadium ng Taipei. Now, really, pero partner, mahaba pa ang oras. Celebrating, oh talaga, mahaba pa to. This is by no means a one game. Here's Lee, kicks it out. Tumama huli. Or may foul, na katawag, laban ni Johnny A. You know, one thing that was very good in the first half on PBA Centennial team only had one turnover. Here's that last foul. The slow-mo brought to you by McDonald's. Partner, you notice that here in the second half, Chinese Taipei, hindi sila nakakaset up for the three-point shot. You notice in the first half, marami silang three-point shot na tinapon. Oh. And uh, naipasok, no? Because they shot close to 70% for three-point range. Talk about, three. talk about three. point shot. Alam mo, they're not getting good looks from that range. Right. Magandang depensa ng Philippines, no? Extending and they're challenging that outside shot. Kanya, hindi na pumapasok yung, yung outside uh, shooting ng uh, Chinese Taipei. Eto naman si Kenneth. Wala rin yung kanyang tira. Wu gets the rebound. Papapasok din lamang ni Wu. Here's uh, Lo. May twin towers combination ng uh, Chinese Taipei. Offensive Ito ano yun? Oh, yes. May banggan, no, con, no foul, no call, and number 15 player again getting the shot. Now, we talked about a twin towers combination partner. Ito, number 15, you see him coming from nowhere and making the shot on the putback. That's Wang. Wang Chun Xiong. In 14 partner, may kalakihan din. No? Si Wu. Oh. Wu and uh, Wang, two tall players now playing simultaneously for Chinese Taipei. Espino, nasa gitna. He has not yet been a contributor to production, but certainly played top defense here. Limpot, nasa labas. Only six seconds sa kanilang shot clock. Meneses, or rather, oh, yes. Meneses and Espino. Dennis Espino. Garbage. Offensive rebound, reverse shot. Nagmamanto man kayo ng Chinese Taipei. Watch, Watch the way yan. they cover the men. Pero nakuha ni Dennis Espino, ha? Yung tinatawag natin basura na, naging gintu pa. Oh, oh. Well, now, takan niya dun si Cheng. He had good position on Cheng for the offensive footback. Under 8 minutes to play. 13-point lead para sa PBA Centennial team. Lo, nasa kanto, fix. Goes up for the 3. Kumalog. Offensive rebound this time by Lee. Wala pa rin. Abarietas gets the rebound. And the little man bringing it down. Johnny, binigay kito Remdes all the way to the basket. It's a 15-point lead para sa Pilipinas. This is the biggest lead. Of the PBA Centennial team, and they're rocking some municipal stadium in Taipei as the Philippines is about seven minutes away from posting a huge, huge win here. Nagsisimula na pong magdiwang ang ating mga kababayan dyan sa Taipei Kinito. And with good reason, labing lima na ang abante natin dito sa championship game. Partner, playing as a team ang ating uh, Centennial squad, no? Kanina nakita natin si Johnny Abrientos with the big defensive rebound. Tapos nakita niya si Kenny Turendez wide open inside for the layup shot. And it's a 15-point lead by the Philippine Centennial team. Pinag uh, pinigyan ng pahinga si Johnny Abrientos. Olsen Rosella is back in the game. He's up against Lee now. Given a screen by uh, Shung. Inilabas. 
outside shot. Voila. Over the back. Two players from the Centennial team challenging that outside shot. And you're seeing uh, tremendous intensity sa defense ng Philippine team. The improvement is uh, very evident. Oh. Only seven minutes remaining. I think man-to-man -man defense than uh, Chinese Taipei. Think about it if it will work. Goremdes gets inside. Oh, oh. It doesn't work. And get it to Remdes again. Penetrating. Alam mo partner nakita nila nagmamantuman itong uh, Chinese Taipei. Sabi siguro ni Kenneth, eh, kayang kaya natin kaya ko to, ito. Oh, malilit ito eh. Compared to sa mga nakalaban oh, natin. Kasi wala silang masyadong trap eh. They're really not pressuring. And if you start your attack from the outside, hindi sila nagdo-double. Oh. And they're not willing to give up their bodies. Ano, oh. Unlike yung mga nakalaban natin, yung Costa Rica, yung uh, even yung uh, Saudi Arabia, talaga uh -huh. ang binabog, binabangga yung ating oh. mga player. Eh. Ito hindi, hindi yata sila sanay sa hindi banggaan. Sanay. Eh, alam naman eh. yung ating kuponan sa PBA. Eh. Eh, yan ang hinahanap oh. nila, no? <laughs> yung banggaan. Tsaka partner, the one thing you also have to uh, uh, appreciate here is the Philippine team is playing intelligently. Oh. They're taking what the defense is giving. On the other hand, mukhang nag nagkakalatoy-latoy na. Luray-luray na yung play ng Chinese Taipei. Hello, Nagkaroon partner, ng uh, ano to, mental lapse itong si yes. Lee. Ha? At partner, pinangaralan itong uh, Chinese Taipei uh, player ng isang referee who is from Chinese Taipei. Uh -huh. And that's a sign of tremendous uh, impartial officiating. So, well, the Philippines is on top by 17. This is our biggest lead. Alan kay Dick. Inside. Limpot. Turnaround. Goal! Oh, yes! 19 point lead para sa PBA Centennial team. We're on our way. Alam mo, partner, parang five barrels ang, ang baril natin. Oh. <laughs> you know? Hindi all double blazing. barrel, eh, no? Oh, all blazing. Ito yung three-point shot. And that time, nakawala ang uh, Chinese Taipei from three-point region. Okay, may konting pressure ngayon coming from the 13, number 13 player. Si Lee. Lee oh. from Chinese Taipei. But uh, very easily crossing the timeline naman ng Philippine Centennial team. Again, looking to run the triangle. Ito yung triangle! Good play, pero wala yung follow-up ni Dennis Espino. Espino, rather... Ni Jun Limpot. Limpot getting the offensive rebound muli. Inilabas nila. And they will set this one up again. Limpot. Out to Olsen Rasela. Wala. Rebound. Nakuha ni Wang. At mukhang si Wang ay pagod na, ha? Pinito, ha? But partner, wala siya pahinga rito. Nakatindig na lamang itong malaking mama ng Chinese Taipei. 16-point lead. Inside pass. Walang papasahan. Inilabas ki Cheng. Cheng quadruple team. <laughs> Kita mo naman, ha? The way that defense is collapsing and Alan Kaidik is called for the foul. But ang anda ng chemistry sa defensa pa. Oh. Yung offense, of course, we know uh, our Philippine team uh, is extremely capable of uh, tremendous firepower. No? Pero yung kanilang defensa, dito nila pinapakita. Kita mo naman the way they collapse on Cheng. At alam naman ng Philippine team natin na ito si Cheng is the most potent gunner of Chinese Taipei. That's Lomo brought to you by McDonald's. As we wind down this ball game, the Philippines on top by 16. It's just a matter of time if we can hang on here. Outside shot. Yes! Three-point shot for Lo. And that lead is down to 13. But partner, it is Olsen Rasela gambled a little bit by playing a defense or doubling the defense on Cheng. Kanya nakawala si Lee. Only that much time remaining here. A little more pressure being employed now. Oh, muntik na maaagaw. Tuluyan ang anagaw. Here's Lo. Or rather, Lee. Nilabas ki Lo. Lo is wide open shot. again. Wala. And there's going to be a foul tulak, there. Oh. Tulak sa ilalim. Lastimosa. And Wu. Making it very clear that he was pushed. And look at this. Alan Kedi calling his teammates Together, to a battle. Yes. Parang, eh, hey, sila. Lapang tayo ng tresa dito. A partner with four and a half to go. Johnny Abarietos sitting on the floor, uh, sitting on the bench. Baka naman kailangan uh, konting substitution na ni Coach Tim Cole. Let's see what he does after this timeout. Well, after this uh, tournament, they certainly will remember Kenneth Doremdes and Marlo Aquino. Oh, without Kahit a doubt. Kahit na pagpalitan pa nila yung kanilang oh. mga uniforme. <laughs> Partner, we saw the glum looks of some Chinese Taipei uh, fans as you take a look at uh, the turnover situation. Huh? Only two turnovers by the Philippine team in this entire game so far. You know, we've talked about the turnovers in so many games, Kinito. Nakita natin how it soared even against Thailand. 
We had about 20 plus turnovers there. Pero dito, dalawa lamang in a championship game, huh? Ito na naman, Rasela on uh, Cheng. Still no sign of Johnny Abarientos checking in. Cheng, nasa labas. Hinahamon ni Rosela. Natapik ni Olsen Rosela, pero may foul na itinawag. Against Rara Rosela. And Coach Tim Cohn giving some instructions to Giorgio Lastimosa. I think uh, they're aware that Cheng is the top gunner, so they want him to give up the ball. They don't want him to take, to take the shot. Ito si Lastimosa yata natawagan ng foul. Or si Rosela. Well, we're not too sure, but it's Cheng on the on the line and he is a deadly shooter dead shot indeed in the crowd dito po sa municipal stadium well this Chinese crowd still hoping for a comeback sa kanilang uh, home team but of course ang ating mga kababayan dyan sa Taipei ay medyo nagdadasal na na matapos ng oras na to ika nga pan mapanalunan na natin itong Jones Cup Cheng another chance here for Chinese Taipei oh nice pass Cheng inside Cheng with the left hand masyado malakas of balance si Cheng and of course that's not his shooting hand alam mo partner ni si Cheng once scored 34 points against Kuwait in the 1993 ABC Championships in Jakarta so he can score under 4 minutes to play we're on top by 12 and hanging on Haidik open for 3 yes PLDD long distance shot para kay Triggerman and the Philippines is Increase their lead to 15 with three and a half remaining. The big difference, the three-point shot of Alan. Uy, nasapal pa ni Alan kay Dick. Tumira ulit si Lee. Patay. All right, humabawi pa si Lee. Chinese Taipei getting the three-point shot back. 12-point lead para sa Pilipinas. At kayong mga nagpupuyat na kasama namin, alam namin hindi nagsasayang ang inyong oras. This is certainly one of our best games here in the Jones Cup. And the boys saving their best for the last. Six seconds sa kanilang shot clock. Espino sa labas, outside shot. Wala. We'd like to thank FedEx, the transportation company of the Jones Cup games. FedEx will live to deliver and talk about delivering. What a great move mula kay Lee as he cuts down that lead to just 10. But it's time on their side. Mukhang nauubusan sila ng oras dito kinito. Oh, partner, I also think that the combination that Coach Tim Cohn has on the floor is a little bit winded, no? Uh, Marlo Aquino, Johnny Abarieto sitting on the bench. Maybe now is the time for the starters to check back in. Ito. Tignan natin itong uh, dribble drive ni uh, Dennis Espino. He was fouled in midair. Nasa apal ng bahag yan, Huang, but the foul came before yes. that. And that was an arm contact, very clear on that replay. And Dennis Espino will be at the stripe. Ito si Johnny Barrientos, bumalik na sa laro. At si Limpot ang uh, mukhang uupo. Alvin, Alvin is coming in. Ito uh, uh, na. This is uh, probably the finishing combination of Coach Tim Cohn checking back in. Alam mo, pambihira talagang suporta ng ating mga OCWs, yung ating mga kababayan. You can see all their posters, their streamers. Talagang uh, dito sa ating taon ng centenario, they're so proud to have a PBA Centennial team who is only about uh, two and a half minutes away from bringing back what we last held back in 85, the Jones Cup. You know, one thing we've noticed about our Centennial team partner, now, this is now a team made up of 12 pieces of the puzzle. Oh, yes. Wala na, wala na superstar dito eh. Wala They've na. left out. Uh, you know, if anyone has had, uh, has shown any ego in the PBA, walang ego-ego dito eh. Wala na superstar dito. Everybody's playing as a as a team. Team player sila. Marlo Aquino incidentally has checked back in. This is the starting unit ni uh, Tim Cohn, maliban ki Giorgio Lastimosa. Outside shot by Law. Wala pa rin. Marlo Aquino controls. A partner under pressure on Chinese Taipei with this big deficit that they have, they're looking for the three-point shot to even things up. No, pero hindi na pumapasok yung three-point shot ng Chinese Taipei. At nakikita mo yung coach ng Chinese Taipei parang sinasabi sa kanyang mga bataan, "Come on, pressure ng konte." But mo kang upos na yung kanilang uh, igang lakas eh. Medyo babad na babad yung mga malalarong ito. In the meantime, it's going to be a foul against Jojo Lastimosa on the attempt to run a fast break. Well, maganda rin ang ginawa ni Giorgio Lastimosa because he stopped the possible transition attack by Chinese Taipei and that's time is the momentum although nasa penalty niya yata tayo so shooting free throws in Chinese Taipei 
So um, Lee will be at the free throw line. Uh, oh, now the drawback of this, of course, is that the shot clock or the game clock will stop and Chinese Taipei will have a chance to uh, trim down the lead with free throws. Lee has been perfect from the free throw line. He has also made three out of seven from the three-point range and three out of six from the field. A total of 18 points already. Make that 19. At ang uh, abanti po ng Pilipinas, bahagyan na lamang natapyas. Abarientos now handling the ball. And they're looking to trap in the backcourt. Torrentes. Safely giving it over to Torrentes. Pinigigim Malo! Nice pass! High speed! Ang and that may be the exclamation oh, point, Kinito. Ang ganda ng pasa galing kay Kenny Torrentes and Marlo Aquino unmolested with a tuck shot. And the last two minutes is being brought to you by Pepsi, the next generation. And the Philippines only a minute and a half away from bagging this 21st William Jones Cup. And there's no denying the PBA Centennial team, Kinito. Not and even that three points point out. Oh, pero mukhang huli na ang lahat para sa kanila. You know, fighting spirit in Chinese Taipei. No, they're not giving up. Ayaw mong siyempre, ayaw mong mapahiya in oh, front oh. of your hometown crowd. Now that lead, less than double figures now. And the Philippine Centennial team is milking the clock. And look at this. You can just feel the intensity, the jubilation ng ating mga kababayan. Diyan po sa Taipei and of course all over the Philippines today. As the Philippines is just a few seconds away from registering this big win sa Taipei. Partner, there was a foul. Wala pa naman sa penalty in Chinese Taipei. They need to be able to stop the clock and give up the fouls. Otherwise, that clock will just run. At matatapos itong laro na to. That much time remaining before we call it a championship. Aquino, oh, eh. sinakyan pa ni Wu. And you know, Marlo Aquino takes it in stride. He has been battered really hey, badly oh. dito sa seryeng ito. Well, hindi naman sinasadya. Oh, hindi sinasadya yan. Ito naman muntik na sakyan talaga. Ewan ko lang kung hindi sinasadya pala yun. Ito, pangita natin, oo. May tuhod yun. And very good-naturedly, si Marlo Aquino accepting the apology of Wu. Half a minute remaining. Kapit pa yan. At kampiyon na po tayo sa Jones Cup. Marlo Aquino! Wala! Offensive rebound sa kanya pa rin. Kaya yun na sa fall. Nakaisa rin ang konti. Two attempts by Marlo Aquino. Walang pumasok. Here's Cheng. Kumuporman tres. Inilabas kay Lee for the three. Short. Rebound by Johnny. Six seconds remaining. And it's gonna be Kenneth Arendes. Oh boy! The duck shot. And that should be it. A ten point win. The Philippines wins the 21st William Jones Cup sa Taipei and a big, big win para kay Tim Cohn. He came, he saw, and he conquered. What a victory para sa PBA Centennial Team, Pinito. Thank you for watching this video, guys, and a little trivia about this game. This 1998 Centennial Team is my second championship dito sa William Jones Cup. Medyo nostalgic for me dahil maganda po yung napakita natin dito and naging proud na naman tayong mga Pilipino. And hope to see you sa next video, Kita Kits, and please don't forget to like and subscribe to my official YouTube channel.